Welcome, eighth graders from East Harden, West Harden, Bluegrass Middle School, North Middle, and James T. Alton. Uh, it's, it's, this is interesting that we're doing it this way. Uh, we look forward every single year having you as, your, as an eighth grader to tour our facility here at the Early College and Career Center because it gives you the insight to choosing a pathway that will ho hopefully lead you to some type of career choice, um, maybe even out of a career choice um, for the next chapter of your life. So I know that there's a lot of question marks over, you know, what does it look like to be a student here at EC3? What does it look like for your day? You know, how do you get here? How do you get home? Here at EC3, you're going to be treated as that young adult um, that is aspiring to do something different. EC3 just does school differently. We operate first on a little bit different schedule, uh, meaning instead of coming here for just one class, uh, one period a day, uh, you come here for two, and that is our typical schedule. We operate where a student might come here for first and second period or for fourth and fifth period at the end of the day. Here at EC3, our classes operate on a more hands-on approach. We want to get your hands into it. You have to be part of the learning um, because that's where we feel like true, authentic learning takes place. We are career focused. You will come here with classmates from Central Harden, John Harden, and North Harden. So you may end up in a class where you look around and all brand new students. We offer bus transportation on a daily basis. Transportation is always taken care of. We don't want students to feel like that there's not a way to get here or to get home. Um, our students that do drive and you have a car, you're welcome to drive here as well. Uh, we just ask for some uh, specific parental permission. Um, and, and you know, those things are taken care of and our students then drive here. You chose EC3 because you're choosing to come here for a specific purpose. Now, students ask this all the time, and they say, you know, how do I get to EC3? Like, not necessarily transportation, because I just covered that, but how do you get in? Uh, to get to EC3, it's competitive, and I hate to tell you all that, because we want everybody, but just like the real world, sometimes it's competitive to get that job that you're aiming for. Well, for us here at EC3, we really look at those work ethic standards. We want every, every child to get into EC3, but because of the request by so many students and by the, only the peer numbers that we can have in certain pathways, work ethic standards may come into play as we're making choices for students. Now, I'm gonna go ahead and be a myth buster on some things because I know it continues to be said out there. Can you only do band and not EC3? Or can you only do choir and not EC3 or, or ROTC? And guys, it's a myth. You can do multiple programs at your home high school, here at EC3, and still make it work. But you have to be very specific when you schedule with that person when we do one-on-one -on -one scheduling and let them know that these are the things you want to do. So we're excited about having you here at EC3 and we hope that we, you choose to make EC3 a part of your high school career because we know that our students that are leaving us and going out into the real world are seeing the benefits of what they've gained right here in EC3. Because you're gonna walk away with something more than just a high school diploma you're gonna walk away with something very tangible. That is an industry recognized certification. Those certifications are part of what the state of Kentucky is looking at for part of the minimum graduation requirements nowadays. And so we're really excited to be able to offer you a certification for the program pathway that you choose here at EC3. We're excited about you choosing EC3. Know that we are always available here for you. And I know that these videos may not answer every single question you have, uh, but we're hoping once uh, these COVID restrictions lift that we're going to be able to get you in here and get your parents in here and be able to show you really what EC3 is all about. But I'm excited for you to take a look at these videos. Uh, and uh, again, if they generate some questions, please reach out to EC3 and we'll be happy to answer those. Thanks.